Hello, everyone, and as always, thanks for being here. I recently checked out an old graveyard, 1819, in Mobile, Alabama. And of course, there always seems to be some sort of weirdness around them. And that's because there always is. I personally like them because most of the time, you're just by yourself. And for me, it's a smaller place you can go to see so many things going on all at one time. Of course, most of the time, things just get more puzzling. But of course, the main reason why I go is to catch all the cooked out bricks. Some people might see weathering over 200 years, but I don't. In most cases, I see bricks doing what they shouldn't be doing by just sitting there. One of the more fascinating things about this place is everything is completely brick. It's all brick internals with an outer covering or rendering. In this particular cemetery, it was founded and established with different sources in 1819. Four acres of mystery with a brick wall that goes completely around it and they attribute 1830 when they built the wall around it. And to me, old graveyards are one of the most untouched things out there. Of course, mostly just being a fear factor for everyone feeling uneasy looking around but as always i'm here for the bricks the cooked out and melted bricks which normally i can always find when the bricks are looking like all the other ruins around the world and something's up so i figured i'd dig around a little bit at this one to see what i could find in some spots where the ground is caved in, brick just continues. I mean, where does it stop? How far does this foundation actually go underground? And why? Why is everything complete brick back in 1816? Cities and towns just getting started, but apparently they had massive factories that made bricks. Of course, you don't see ruins of brick factories much. And the few that remain today mostly just have a plaque and uh, that's a red flag. What are we looking at actually? I have no idea. I'm just looking at all the brick and why is it changing? Why does it look cooked out? Why does it look here. melted? What happened? You got this corner of this slab stone. And you would think, let's see, did they did they repair this? And make it just like the stone here. I don't know with this brick. is definitely in a weird spot. It's the only one, it's the only spot here. See, we got 1829, 1829, and let's see, can we see? 18, well, I'll give up on that one. So, 18, 29, 29. And this one says, well, it's almost completely gone. Why do they all look different? It's the same year. I mean, I don't know the year this was, but probably close to this one. I must have not got the memo, but 
This is all brick internals. This whole thing is brick. Curved bricks. Was there a curved brick factory also in 1819? This looks very techy. I don't think I've seen one quite like this. Everything has brick, internals, most of it. It's like, you have all this is brick, and then you have that. Everywhere. Everything's brick. Everywhere. Yeah, shocker there. See here, the whole thing is made of brick, even that. It's just time and weathering, 200 years less, don't worry about it, it's fine. There's a body under there, I'm gonna go snooping around. Such a variety. All brick. Minus the outer covering, coating, rendering. It's like heat damage brick. On this side. Now this was for a slightly bigger fella. That's why we had to bow these out on both sides. And for some reason, this side didn't get as damaged as this side during the bad lightning storms. And of course, this over here looks way worse than this. And don't worry about why this slopes down a little bit more than this one. Yeah, they. This is all they had to work with. Quite interesting piece here. Looks extremely damaged. Probably from heat. sure it's just not going to deteriorate like that and give that effect. Barely see the writing. What's happened here? Why would weathering do this on this side and something else on this side? All the way down. Maybe we should ask Mary. So what were we doing back in 18, 19, 20, 30? Whatever. Why all the brick? And this is also brick here. Why not just cap it off level? They do have those in here. Here's one. Guess what? It's all brick. The wall goes around this complete cemetery it's like four acres it goes around the whole thing 
just more cooked out mess. All the bricks are different. And you have this piece. I would assume they're not just going to stick something else besides all these hundreds of thousands of bricks. What, what was that? Possibly brick. So here we have like, looks like a top of a house. Still confused on why would you ever do that? Is that necessary? This is all brick, everything. Murdoch. We know Mr. Murdoch has got brick all around him. It's right there. It's broken. And uh, that's it. How far does that go down? I don't know. Why would you make that brick casing concrete whatever and then put this whole entire thing around it yeah make that make sense because it doesn't all right what in the hell is this i have no clue there's something on it see here and here you have all these lines going all different directions there there of course this was the only one in a cemetery like this just no clue i don't know extremely weird here these are just stuffed into these bricks weirdness nothing just have to look at closely what's going on here why is it looking so different and different damage why does everything look so scorched so here you got this missing did they just put it down here? It looks seems to match up slightly. Why is it so different? Even in the background, you've got this white piece. Looks like the corner, and it's not the same. Do love the trees here. Just tremendous. Just some bricks laying on this particular gravestone, or whatever you want to call it, tomb. Mortarless bricks on this side. I think that might be just laying there. Don't know, but why does this brick look like that? And this one's totally black and cooked out. What's going on there? This side, the rendering, the outer covering is completely gone. It's come off. See the damage all over it. Example of everything in this cemetery is brick, brick internals, outer covering. 
somewhat of a close shot there. Why is this all gone? It's not gone over here. This one just totally not making sense. I don't even know really what to make of this. So are you just you building this one? Stick that on top of it. And you build a big one here. And I guess you just got to share a room with all these people nestled up. Why is this one so close? Can you move that over like two inches? I guess they didn't do that back then. 1826. 1826. Okay. So here, obviously, just weirdness. And But the point is here, you've got this coming out. It's in the middle here. This one is not in the middle. It's halfway in between here. And this one over here is just what what happened? If these are what they say they are, shouldn't all these be in the middle? Of course, then they have or did have something here, but it's totally gone. What causes this? Rain? Wind? There's a brick. It's all brick. So you can see faint lettering on each one of these. Why is it gone like that? And why does this one look like this? I still don't know. It does look like something happened to it because you can still see the lettering faintly under it. Who knows? But there's a piece of brick right there. Underneath the tomb. Okay, we have brick internals as usual. But what's this? So you're, build, you're building more under it. You build this and you build all this on top. But why? To protect it from the rain? Even more in 18 whatever? Mortarless? Hmm. How did it do that to just this brick? So here it looks like you had some outer covering, but why would you go over it with this perfect stone here and then you're going to put this on top of it i'm going to add another one for good measure i mean the means and money back then it just must have been a good time if you died you know you could you know you're going to live in not maybe quite biggest house as you were in but it looks pretty comfortable Probably goes way down deep, too. For no reason. We're going to follow the stones. This one looks pretty decent. A little damage here. I mean, logically. But what's happening here? It's all built the same. Same time. I would think maybe even the same day. What? What's going on here? Brick internals, no covering, no mortar. This big block is pretty interesting. This is dipped down, almost like it's melted in. Why does it look like that just right there? Why? Why does it look like that? Strolling up. What's going on here? What's the top here? And this little trinket here looks totally melted. I just, just want to throw that out there. I don't know. Could have been broken off a little, but great example. In my mind, I'm thinking all this was brick, just like this here. 
outer covering it's all changed from from heat another angle why is all this covering gone every bit of it cooked cooked devastated brick changing or this almost looks like one of those tombstones that lay on top of it possibly it's changing but regardless there's brick all around it like the cemetery architects like what what were they on honestly it, what's the what is the purpose of this See, the storm always comes in from this, this side here, but just right here. It, it doesn't affect any of this other stuff, except a little bit here and here and here. The weather's really, really random. Don't worry about this cooked outbreak right here. Fried here, 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 here. Fried everywhere. Okay, what we're going to do here with Mr. Bob Joe, we're going to get real fancy. We're going to, we're going to do this. Yeah, he's got a couple extra gold coins his family gave me, and so we're going to do this little decoration on top. We're going to make it look real nice. Oh, and we're going to, we're going to put this on this side. Just slap it on the side. And then it's going to deteriorate like this. Daniel Duvall, 1824. Okay. Got a little Society of Mayflower descendants. Okay. Well, we do know this is all complete brick with an outer covering. Brick internals. Here, here. Way more fancier than this guy over here. Uh, you can see it's all brick. You can see the lines. It's all brick down here. All right, we're going to put this one in, and we're going to go one level up. And this was the rich guy in the neighborhood. That's why he got this. So what's going on? Did they, they couldn't complete the rest of this with a brick? Why does this look like concrete? And this is whatever. What what happened here? 